Almost everyone with a smartphone, a tablet, or an iPod Touch loves gaming apps, especially kids. They're free and they're simple to use. Unfortunately, many parents are not aware that those free apps can run up big charges in the hands of your children. Free apps, Angry Birds, for example, are now loaded on millions of smartphones and iPads. But a growing number of parents are getting hit with huge bills for what's known as in-app purchases. That's when little Johnny buys stuff when playing games, not realizing that mom and dad will be billed in real money. The website ConsumerAffairs.com says one girl ran up $700 of in-app purchases from Dragon Veil, a popular kids app. Another spent over $1,000 in real money buying Smurf berries from a Smurf app. And from the Doesn't That Stink file, the way app makers allow kids to spend their parents' money. Despite headlines about parents protesting, app vendors are reluctant to change anything because it's a big money maker. Doesn't that stink? The good news, Apple, hit with several lawsuits over this last year, now requires an iTunes password to make in-app purchases. The problem is that many parents give their kids their iTunes password, and that stinks too. Bottom line, make sure you check out any app that you let a child use. If it allows purchases, make sure your young one understands not to make any, and that way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.